Hey guys, it's Winters here. I'm here to uh, preview uh, the 2008-2009 Kansas State basketball team. Uh, hopefully this team can uh, go to the NCAA tournament again. Even not, if they can just go to the NIT, I think I'd be satisfied with that. I don't know about you guys, but we, of course we lost Michael Beasley and Bill Walker. And if you want it, we also lost Blake Young and Clint Stewart. Maybe they were holding us back, who knows. But... Of course, losing Mike is a huge loss, and now we're gonna have we're gonna need someone to step up and and uh, be a be a playmaker. And I definitely think Jacob Holland can be that playmaker. Only Frank can play him more. I mean, Frank didn't really play him as much as he probably could last year. Questionable, but who knows? Dennis Clemente, I've I've heard he's very quick. He's very fast, and he probably could definitely. Excuse me. Uh, Get us some points. I, I don't know how much how uh, how to say that really. And we got Jam and Jamar Samuels. Uh, hopefully he, he's been a uh, pretty good uh, offensively this first couple games, in which the Cats have won both games so far. We got Dominique Sutton, who's our slasher, and he can definitely score for us uh, as long as he doesn't shoot the three pointer. I mean, he should he would probably shoot maybe seventy percent. He's been ver he's been very well on those layups lately. And then you got oh, uh, Bucci Oweji. Uh, questionable right now. You got Luis Colon. Okay, Luis Colon. You got Ron Anderson, who's a pretty solid player. Uh, wasn't that great last year. I mean, he was in the USC game, and that's what we're hopefully going to see from him. Anyway, K State has a very weak non con schedule. They should win 11, 12 games possibly in their non con. I mean, they have Kentucky, Iowa, or West Virginia, and Oregon. Eh, maybe Southern Miss. Yes, Southern Miss. And the rest are just cupcakes. I mean, who knows? We might get uh, upset. Who knows? It's college sports, after all, where the upset lives. But I could definitely see the Cats winning 10-plus games going into the conference. And in the conference, this is where it's going to get really, uh, it's very questionable. Now, most of these teams are going to be mediocre in the Big 12 North. You got KU, bringing in a lot of young talent. They'll probably develop towards midseason, kind of like K-State last year. Excuse me. You got Nebraska, who loses Alex March. Probably the best player, but who knows, they might improve. They're very questionable. Uh, Missouri, they're just mediocre. Iowa State, they're just terrible. You got Colorado, which they, 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 could, be, they could be better than uh, they were last year. I could definitely see that. They could def definitely be an improved team, but I don't see them being great or good or even mediocre at that. Maybe at the bridge brink of mediocre mediocrity. So uh, Oklahoma will be good, Texas will be good. Uh, eh, you could probably you could probably uh, say uh, oh Baylor will be good. Texas A M, Texas Tech, Oklahoma State, they'll be pretty good. The Big Twelve South is solid. Big Twelve North mm -hmm. definitely not so much. So I could definitely see uh, K State beating Texas A M and Texas Tech. But losing to Oklahoma State, Baylor, Oklahoma, and Texas, and probably losing to KU at KU, and probably at Nebraska, because we just can't win up there in the Devaney Center. Uh, could definitely see us losing it in Columbia again. I could see us winning the rest. I think we'll we could probably go 9-7, and 10-6, and 8-8 eight and eight in conference play, but I just don't think it'll be enough for that weak non-con schedule. We could win 11... Uh, not 11, excuse me, 21, 22 games, and I think we'll still go to the NIT. It's, it'll be kind of like a 06, 07 season, where uh, I think we'll have good defense, we'll have pretty decent offense, but it just won't get the job done, as we won't have enough key wins, so to speak. And we'll go to the NIT, don't know what we'll do in there, that's about my prediction. Go to the NIT, I think we'll be satisfied with that. And then, 2009, 2010, Rodney McCruger. Wally Judge, Nick Russell. Things will be good in case they land. Thank you for watching this uh, preview here. If you uh, would, if you like the channel, please subscribe. Me and Sork will have more stuff coming. We also have a live show, which we will probably be advertising or pimping out, so to speak, uh, soon. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.